Well, it's been a while since we've done one of these. Today, we are gonna open a hundred pound mystery box created by Pokemon Burnham on Instagram. I'll put a link in the description, but let's take a look and see what's inside. <laughs> Right, so this is quite a big box and I won this in a raffle so I didn't actually pay a hundred pounds it was a raffle for a hundred pound mystery box what Scott does that's his real name Scott we've mentioned him on the channel before I'll put a link in the description for his Instagram because he does raffles all the time almost daily and they are so worth it if you can get a win then uh, the prize is just fantastic he just recently did two team rocket theme decks sealed at 10 pound per ticket which is a bargain absolute bargain unfortunately I didn't win but we are going to take a look what's inside the box the big box um, and I mean normally the format is we're going to see if it's worth it but I'm, I just want to see what's in it really because you know it's it's Pokemon right so I've got the box down here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab some stuff out and then we'll go through right I'm gonna be off to the side I'm gonna have my side profile for a minute and we're just gonna pull some stuff out so first off we have a note the note says congratulations on winning yourself my hundred pound mystery box chef uh, I love putting these together for the community just promise me you will open it on yep on a video not a rebel clash in sight um aka rebel trash thanks again all the best scott pokemon burnham and then we've got a pokemon card which just says enjoy and bits and pieces so we'll put them off to the side we're going to move the packing stuff oh some more packing stuff um and we're going to get stuck in there's some sealed products in here i can see so first off Oh, sorry earphone users, that's probably pretty savage. So first off, we'll just go down to the hand cam here. We've got a Vivid Voltage Blister of a single booster pack. We've got something else wrapped up in bubble wrap. Oh, so this isn't cards. This is not cards. So what's this? Oh, fantastic. We've got a Squirtle. We've got the OG Squirtle. That is awesome. That's going to look fantastic on a shelf, I reckon. Awesome, so we'll pop that off to the side. We have got a, oh, we have got, um, I'll do this down on the cam down here. So we've got an envelope with some old school almost cards. Fantastic. Um, we have got an envelope with some packs. So we get to rip some packs and see what hits we get, if we get any, fingers crossed. Oh, We've got some Haribo sweets. Chow down on them. Not a fan of sweets, so that'll probably go to the daughter. Um, we have got a gala tin. Is this a gala tin? I think this is a gala tin. Oh, this is exciting. Um, and, yep. We'll pop that down by the side. Right, and um, we'll just have a look down here. Um, so we've got a Hidden Fates tin. But there is not a Hidden Fates promo card there, so I'm guessing there is going to be stuff in. So what I think we'll do is we'll have a look through this Hidden Fates tin first and see what we got. So when I won this on the raffle, not only was I just, you know, over the fucking moon to win. Um, Scott also asked me what my favourite Pokemon was, what sets I like, and all of that kind of stuff. So in this tin, we have got some Japanese packs. Now, I haven't opened a lot of Japanese packs. I've got a few, uh, I think I've got a video of doing the Vault Tackle, but we've got this. I think this is like a tag team pack, or is that a tag team pack? I don't know the names of these packs. I know that that is like a, um, like Battle Styles cards um, from the two sets that got released. So we'll rip them open. Oh, we've got some hard plastic to put our pools in. Hopefully we do get some pulls, some more hard plastic. You should always, always, uh, you know, use hard plastic, guys. We've got some um, damage counters, so well, some, and we've got tag team, our ta GX tag team counter thing. We have got a packet of energy cards because, you know, can never have enough energy cards. Absolutely. Um, we've got a nice little, uh, what would Jesus do bracelet, but it's what would Pokemon do, I guess. 
We've got some dice, um, Battle Styles dice. As you can see, we've got the little Battle Styles logo here. Oh, and then we've got a tin. We've got a Shining Fates tin here. Um, and is there going to be is there going to be booster packs or is there going to be cards? We'll take a look. So, yeah, Scott asked me what sets I like and what Pokemon I like as well. Now, I'm a little bit of a like basic bitch when it comes to it. I like Pikachu and I like Mew. They're my kind of my go-to. I like the artworks most on them. But then I also like Celebi. I also like Jirachi. I kind of like all the little cutesy Pokemon um, because I am basic and, you know, that is just me. Um, so I did give a few sets that I like. Obviously, I like the expensive sets. So, you know, I can't imagine there'd be many of them in here because the expensive sets are hard to get and they are expensive. But... I see that we've got a few Celebi cards, so we've got a few Celebis here, which is awesome. We've got the Reverse Hollow Mew from Hidden Fates, which I haven't pulled yet, and I really, really love that. Uh, we've got a Coffin Reverse Hollow, Rowlet. So I did say I like the Fates, you know, the Hidden Fates, the Shining Fates. So fingers crossed we've got a few of them packets. Um, we've got a Frostmoth Hollow, a Thievel, the Bastard Thieving Fox, a Nickit. We've got a reverse holo in Didi, um, a holo owl. Oh, we've got the unbroken bonds promo. Um, was this from the build and battle set? Very, very pleased with that. Very nice. Um, and then we've got some older cards. So we've got Entai holo. Oh, nice. We've got the Zapdos holo as well. I haven't pulled that from um, Hidden Face either, I don't think. I like that. I like that. It's the, the cracked, the cracked holo. We've got Bill's analysis reverse holo. Misty's Water Command, always a fan of the Misty cards, um, you know, just because of, you know, the, the, the original Pokemon. The original Pokemon stuff had Misty and Brock. Eevee, the Eevee Hollow, I pulled this recently. I'm glad to have another one because that, the, ooh, the artwork, the artwork on that is just amazing. I just, I love it when you have other Pokemon on Pokemon cards, not just one Pokemon. So I like that very much very much some lovely cards in here we've got brock's training uh, holographic as well and then we've got a reverse hollow star you and then we've got hollow vaporeon just another like hidden fates just their their hollow cards just amazing and then we've got a reverse hollow misty's determination and then we've got a holographic jesse and james and do you know i hope this uh i'm not going to take it out of the um the sleeve now but I've got a Jesse James Hollow, but the, the condition of it is very poor. The centering was extremely off, and it just wasn't great. So I think we're off to a great start, actually. Some great cards there, mainly from Hidden Fates, which uh, makes me very happy. Um, I would like to have a, a complete set of Hidden Fates, and it is proving to be very difficult. Very, very difficult. Right, so next... Should we open some packets? Should we open some of these Japanese cards? Now, I'm not going to pretend to know all the names because I struggle when I'm opening the English packs, if I'm honest. But let's have a look. Um, I will put, for these packs, I'll put the price up um, on the screen somewhere just so we can keep track because the format normally is, you know, is it worth it? Um, and if I'm honest, you know, this was a raffle win. So I don't want to delve too much in the is it worth it because this was more kind of tailored to my taste and what I like so I know that there's going to be some bangers in here so is it it's one from the back isn't it on Japanese cards so here we go so we've got Colonel Mustard, Tepig, a Galarian Slowbro uh, Slowpoke, um, a, is that a Click Clank and then we've got and then this is our rare which is a Pokemon I don't know the name of but um, very nice, very nice. I, I have to say that with the Japanese cards, the uh, the condition of the cards just always seems so much better than the uh, English cards, which kind of sucks because I don't really collect Japanese cards, if I'm honest. So we're going to go break into this one with the Zard on the front. Um, I'm just gonna just gonna use the knife to get into it. I'm looking forward to seeing what's in the old school cards. If there's some. Um, Wizards of the Coast stuff in there. That would be amazing. Wow, I'm really not doing well at opening these. So one from the back again. Let's go. Maybe we can get a holographic or a, something like that. 
So we've got a, a trainer a trainer card, item card, then we've got one of them. One of them, then is that a Murkrow? And then is that is that like that's not a Delmise, is it? It's not a Del ah, just whatever it is. And that is our rare. So you only get five cards. If if um you haven't seen Japanese cards before, which I'm sure you have, um you get five cards per pack. Um and yeah, that's it. Apart from like uh, the special, the special packs like Shiny Star V, um, and then I think this is like the tag team pack. So that would be great to get a tag team on this. There's the big boy again, Tangler. Know that one. And then we got Galarian Meowth. Oh, wicked! I don't know what Pokemon this is, but wow, just the hollows in Japanese is just so much nicer because you got the silver going all the way round with the hollow. That is just fantastic. I like that a lot. We'll be putting that off to the side. Oh, amazing, amazing stuff. So, I think we should open some more packets before we have a look in our old school cards. Um, I'm really excited about the old school cards. So, we're going to open this tin. Um, I think this is a gala tin. I can't remember what comes in here. Oh, wow, wow. So having a bit of fucking trouble opening this up god if my desk wasn't a mess it already it's going to be a mess now right so all right cool coin so we've got darkness of blaze love darkness of blaze set still chasing that um charizard v max and then of course we've got sun and moon um i you know i've been quite lucky with sun and moon we've had some good hits from sun and moon um so we'll start with sun and moon first so fingers crossed we get something and we got the co-card there's your co-card you're welcome enjoy if we're getting hits on these co-cards then let me know in the comments i would love to hear bold bowl door we've got a timer ball uh, a brie uh, brioni uh, a cosmog rowlet young goose a, a torkoal litten and then we've got a reverse hollow litten with all the fire, just fantastic. And then we have got a regular rare cloister. Cool, OG, OG Pokemon. Right, on to the Darkness of Blaze. Now I like Darkness of Blaze set a lot, very much. So let's get stuck in. Um, why am I struggling? Like recently, I've been struggling so much with opening packets and it's just, it's winding me up proper winding me up there's your co-card four from the back of course let's go energy a clang uh, a gothrita a gothi a goth a gothorita we got a trainer piers a squavit spinnerack la vesta a hippopop a hippopotos a golet um a very very happy um Arctiv arctivish reverse hollow and a blazerkin Hollow, fantastic. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, fucking, what a great, what a great hollow. What a great, I don't get too excited about some hollows, but that is just loving, loving that. Right, so let's, um, I think what we'll do is we'll see what packs, we'll see what packs are in here. Because um, I know there's, I'm, I mean, I'm hoping there's going to be some some of the packs that I, that I said that I liked. But we got Battle Styles. Two battle styles. We've got two sword and shield. I ain't mad at that. I like the sword and shield base. We've got ah unified minds. Fantastic. Love unified minds. We've got two shining fates. Good, good. And a champion's path. Wicked. So we're gonna start off with battle styles because if I'm honest, I'm not the biggest fan of battle styles. I've opened a lot of battle styles and I've hit fuck all. So maybe today is when that changes maybe so co card let's see what we have hit so we've got energy cedra weeping bell xp share hound door liquor tongue horsey manky mawile um a carnivine reverse hollow and a center scorch center scorch regular rare awesome okay so no no hits there but that's all right. We've got plenty more to get stuck into. Right, battle styles again. Let's fucking have ya. Oh, that came off. That came off uh, nice and easy. There you go. Let's go. Dublade. 
pig knight. So that's what we got. That we got a pig knight, a scroll of swells, a chim, a chimenko, a hone edge, horsey. Love that artwork. Mankey, Galarian Slowpoke, Licker Tongue, and oh my god, we've got we got the single strike mustard. We got the Colonel Mustard full art train. Anybody else want a whiskey? Yeah. Oh man. Oh right. Uh, honestly. This is probably the best card I've pulled from Battle Styles, and I've opened a lot of Battle Styles, and I'm just extremely fucking happy with that. We got the Colonel Mustard, we got the Full Art Trainer. I'm glad it's not Rainbow because I'm not a big fan of the Rainbow uh, Trainers, but that is phenomenal, phenomenal. Oh, oh, thank you, Scott. Thank you very, very much. Honestly, check them out, check them out. But um, right, so we'll do um, we'll do Sword and Shield next. We'll crack on with the sword and shield. Let's go. So, co card for you. Four from the back. What have we got? We've got a fire, a feather thorn, crushing hammer, kingler. Oh, crabby, nice. Uh, Galarian ponita, very, very cool. Cottony, score bunny, a drampa reverse hollow. And we have got a hollow cinderace. Okay, okay. Let's move on. We've got another short sword and shield um, with the Lapras on the front. Let's go. Oh man, what am I doing with my life trying to open these cards? Right, there we go. There's your co-card. Let's see if we can get something. I mean, I think I've hit some gold cards from sword and shield. Hoot Hoot, Score Bunny, Pikachu. Fantastic, love Pikachu as I've just said. A Whimsicott and... A Reggie Rock V. There we go. We got two hits so far. Look at the big rock bastard. Right, so we're going to move on to Champion's Path. Champion's Path, very divided. People are not happy with Champion's Path, were they? At all. I haven't opened that much Champion's Path, if I'm honest. I'm still sitting in on ETB, which I don't really want to open. There's the code, but I do want the Charizard out of the ETB, Rotten Bike, Suspicious Food Tin, Hyper Potion, Galarian Zigzagoon, Vulpix, Rockeruff, Purloin, Galarian Lin Noon, Lin Noon, Team Yell Grunt, and a Lycan Rock Hollow. Okay, okay, it will take the Lycan Rock Hollow, but we all know, we all know that we hit that all the time on Champion's Path. I think I haven't opened that much, but I've had a lot of the Lycan Rock. So. I mean, we'll take it, we'll take it. Right, we're going to leave the Unified Minds for the last out of these ones. So we got Shining Fates. Can we get another Zard? That would be, that that would just be absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing, but we'll have to see. So, Ball Guy, Tropius, Cremorant, Grossy Fleur, Dick on a Bench, Coffin, Round Cactus, uh, Grossy Fleur. Is that, so we, we've, We've got two Gossy Fleur in one. That's not cool. Oh, we got a baby shiny Impidimp. Impidimp, look at him. <laughs> he looks so... He looks freaky as fuck. And then we've got Boss's Orders. Let's uh, not focus on that. Fantastic. We got a baby shiny of an Impidimp. Looking all impy. And what have you. Man, okay, cool. We got we got a baby shiny. We got a baby shiny. We got Full Art Trainer, baby shiny. Now we got Charizard, the big boy Charizard. So, what are we going to get? Can I open it? Can I? God. God. Leave a comment down below of which is your favourite pack that I've received in this pack of packs. Four from the back. Right. Energy. Rusted Sword. Uh, gym Trainer. Thwacky. Dick on a Bench. Trap Inch. Nickit. Boozil. Boozil. Coffin. Sobble. Oh, my God. We've got another baby shiny. What's... Oh, no. We've got another baby shiny of a Sobble, and we've got an Alkarine VMAX Rainbow Rare. We got a secret rare, secret rare. Yes, let's go, let's go. I can't believe, I can't believe that. That is just fucking oh, icing on the cake. So we got the Sobble baby shiny, and we got that Alkarine. All right, we'll put them on the hits pile. Damn, damn, it's just, it's lucky, man. It's just, I'm just, I'm feeling, I'm feeling lucky. So what are we gonna get in un Unified Minds? Oh, something, something good. I hope. Right, there's your co-card. Four from 
the back. Sorry, my light just went out. But anyway, let's get into it. We've got a fairy energy. Nice to see you, fairy energy. A mesprite and a magnemite. A slackoth, just chilling with a fruit axle. A, fletch, a fletchinder. Stunfish. A dupinder. Nice. And an exadrill rare. An exadrill rare. Okay. Okay, but we've got we've got a nice a nice reverse hollow there. Definitely prefer the sun and moon hollows to the sword and shield. Sword and shield hollows look rubbish. You can barely read what some of the moves are sometimes. Right, oh man. The amount of rubbish that's here. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So also let me know if you want me to do more like um, more mystery boxes, because I love doing mystery boxes very much. Right, so we are now going to take a look in the old school the old school almost packs so we've got a couple oh right so we've got a couple of things here and so it's who's that pokemon who's that pokemon we're not going to guess that. well i mean we'll try and guess but i'm not sure um there's many pokemon to pick from isn't there to guess on that so we are going to start off we have got base set to energy awesome another base set to energy right here we go so these are these are the cards man these are the cards so we've got a jungle gloom we have got a jungle execute a team rocket ekins oh fantastic base set to goldine a fossil geodude wow we have got a mantine i uh, i don't know what set this is from um, I'm unsure about what set that is from. I'm sure you guys can let me know what set that's from. We have got the Team Rocket Drowsy. Oh, this is just, this is just, it's so nice going through all these old cards just from when, you know, when it all kind of like first started. Just fantastic. Bell Sprout from Jungle. We have got a Fossil Krabby. Uh, a Furret from the same set as what these are from. A Statler. Wow. Uh, a grand bull and then we've got uh, going back to jungle we've got jungle spiro a jigglypuff i love the jigglypuff artwork here these um these cards are looking like you know in pretty good nick for how old they are as well we've got a nidoran from jungle a team rocket zubat a fossil wheezing so now we've got a pokemon trader um which is that i think that's just from base set isn't it yeah Oh, yeah, it gets sleeved. So, yeah, we've got a Pokey Gear. We have got Scoop Up Trainer. Oh, fantastic. These are just mint, like, honestly. We've got a Murkrow. So, are these ones that are sleeved up? Yeah, these are rare. These are rare. Oh, wow. Like, honestly, like, the condition of these are just for how old they are. Just fantastic. We've got um, a, a Team Rocket Squirtle. Oh, my God. So this is, you know, this is base set. Oh my god, we've got base set nine tails hollow. Wow, wow. I mean, for me, for me, this is this is just to, to throw this in, to throw this in is just fucking awesome. And then we've got a mag a magby as well from um, I don't know what set. I need to find out what set it's from. But still, that that is fantastic. And the condition, the condition. But I mean, let's focus on this base set nine tails and i've got a base set nine tails but it is fucked honestly i mean obviously the condition's not going to be great like i'm not expecting mint but wow i'm going to send that off to be graded because this is just a good one to just get slabbed up and have like for me anyway that's fantastic absolutely fantastic god that's just a, it's this it's nice just going down memory lane and hitting the nostalgia you know because that's what we feed on really so who's that pokemon who do you think it's gonna be i don't know i'm just gonna get a like stab in the dark i'm gonna say jirachi I don't, I don't know why but i just am so let's just rip this and see oh oh kind of close with the jirachi really but we've got a celebi amazing rare fantastic i'll take i'll take this card all day long awesome awesome we'll take that and then what have we got here who's that pokemon maybe it's a pikachu um, well, I've just seen green, so I know it's not. Ah, oh, wicked. We've got a fossil. 
um, hollow muck. Wow. And that, again, again, that is in great condition. Great condition. Just needs a bit, bit, just, I don't know if that's actually, if that's on the card, that's fine. That can clean off. But, oh, fantastic. Oh, man, these old cards. These old cards. I know the Celebi, I know the Celebi is not an old card. I'm guessing that's what the almost uh, is referencing. Right, so we're down to our last, our last bit, you know. So has this been worth it? I would say it's been worth it. I would say there's definitely... You know, with all of these old cards, if you price them up all, you know, individually, which I'm afraid I'm not going to do. I'm not going to do that. Uh, this is not what this video is about today. This is just about opening some older stuff, opening some newer stuff and just having fun, really. So we're going to open the Vivid Voltage pack. Um, I will put prices up for a few of the cards, obviously. But um, I've, we've got one more pack to open. We've got this lovely promo of Score Bunny. Oh, Oh no, which um, I'm having a bit of trouble getting out. I'll get that out um, at a later date or later on today. There's your co-card. So we've got Vivid Voltage. Let's have a look. Imagine, imagine if we hit the Rainbow Rare Pikachu right now. Can you imagine? There's your co-card. Come on, last pack, last pack. Energy, a Trumbeak, Hitmontop, Blitzel. Milkery, just you know, a droplet of cum. Skiddo, Eevee, Trubbish, piece of shit rolling around in pizza. We've got an Eevee and ah, oh, we've got a do a Duralad, a Duralandun, um, hollow to end to end on. Right, so just a little. I mean, for me, the 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 big thing in this is the Nine Tails base set. You know, the Nine Tails base set. It's looking good, so so good. So um, check out my um, last video. We're doing a graded card giveaway, which released on Wednesday, um, because you are maybe watching this on Sunday when it comes out. Um, and make sure you get involved. Head, head over to my Instagram to see how to win the card uh, from the giveaway. Um, I want to say a big thank you to Pokemon Burnham for putting on bangers of raffles. Link will be in the description. I was Chris. That was Pokemon. Stay safe. Bye.